How you doing? Good, man. How you doing? Hi, Daryl. Nice to meet you. Hi. Nice to meet Love you. Love the bow tie. Nice to shake hands. I know, I know. I'm like, right? you know, uh, you know, we got our hand sanitizer, so we're I good, know, you know? know. It feels so good. It feels so good. <laughs> I never know. Should I shake hands? I know, hands? I know. I'm like, should I wear a mask? Like, what should I do? Right. You know, no, we're in this new world now. Yeah, you know? Thank you. So you play John Hammond. Tell us about the relationship between John and Aretha Franklin. Well, John Hammond was the first person to give her a recording contract, to give her, to put her in a recording studio, and um, he was instrumental in a lot of amazing uh, singers and musicians, you know, John, um, Bruce Springsteen, and Bob Dylan, and Billie Holiday, he's an amazing, he's in a legend of himself, but um, for this movie, he, he starts her out, and, um, you know, she has a... It's, it's a great first step, but uh, she needed to go further and, and discover her own voice. And then playing this character, what did you learn about Aretha that you didn't know before in general? Well, I, I didn't know that she had such a complicated relationship with her dad and her family and, and just growing up. I, I just thought she was the queen of soul, you know, like she was born into that, you know, and I didn't realize the struggle that she went through and, and what she had to do to find her own voice. And I think she's calling me. I, th I think she's the, calling you right now. She knows. World. <laughs> and <laughs> unfortunately, it's under spam risk, so I, I can't talk to her right now. <laughs> that's a, that was amazing. No, that was amazing. <laughs> no, that's great. Uh, what's your go-to Aretha Franklin song? I mean, there's so many in her library, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, uh, God. Yeah, I know, I know. I, I can't think of uh, I can't think of it. Talk to me after the movie. Okay. <laughs> That'd be good. I love that. And then. I hear, all I hear is that Jennifer just embodied Aretha so much, and it was so much emotions on set. What was one of your favorite scenes that you saw her film playing Aretha? Well, I haven't seen the film yet. Oh, you haven't seen it at but, all? Okay. But being with Jennifer on set was, I mean, I, I, saw, I never met Aretha Franklin, but I feel as though I kind of know who she is. Um, Jennifer is incredibly kind and very sweet human being to work with, but she has this power that she, she, she can afford to be kind and sweet because she is like rich with talent and uh, n sort of knowledge of who Aretha was that it really was a pleasure to act with her because it was just effortless. It's, it felt effortless. I'm sure she didn't feel as though it was effortless, but come, working with her was sort of an effortless experience. Well, we can't wait to see you in the film and congratulations and uh, learning more about John. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah. John Hammond, man. Look him up. It's amazing life. Thank you. Thanks a lot, man.